What we are in right now is the first phase uh, of the spread of the virus. This is the phase uh, that uh, runs to a certain extent uh, unchecked or, or difficultly checked through uh, our, our society, through our communities. Uh, we're seeing new cases pop up here and there. We're seeing people uh, struggle to uh, handle it and to keep these uh, measures uh, from overwhelming our healthcare system. If we do things right, this will be the first and worst phase that we go through as a country in terms of COVID-19. According to the models we've put forward, it is possible that we will be able to be out of that wave uh, this summer. And at that point, we will be able to talk about loosening up some of the rules that are in place, uh, looking at particular sectors where uh, people can go back to work, uh, bringing in new rules around how people can uh, interact uh, with each other in society and get things rolling again. We'll have to be very careful about how we do that, and we will have to remain vigilant and active every single day for possible resurgences of the virus. Once we're through this first phase, be able to get back to something that is more normal, but we will not get back to the normal that we had before, uh, at least until uh, we have developed uh, a vaccine for the virus. That is the reality, but the funda fundamental bottom line that people can reflect on this weekend is if we stay strong in our social distancing measures now and for the coming weeks, we can see how things can start getting back to normal uh, in the coming months and uh, we will be able to get through this because that's what Canadians do.